Hey guys, hello and welcome back to my channel. I am Priyanka and you are watching Homely Mess. Finally, it's that day when I have accumulated all my energy to clean and organize my house. And guess what? This time I will be taking you along to be a part of my day. This is my minimalist home, which is a work in progress. Taking care of it every day is not really possible, and hence I dedicate only few hours in a week to organize it. I follow an intense cleaning ritual, most of which I have captured here for you. But before getting into this, I make sure I have a rested mind and body. Because only when you take care of yourself will you be able to take care of other things. So here I am starting with my living room, going to give this sofa a nice clean with this lint remover. This is a very easy way to remove all the dust. But since today I am going for a deep clean, so I am also going to vacuum clean it. Cleaning sometimes acts as a meditation ritual for me, where although I am repeating the same process, but I am also being very mindful. It is a compassionate way of taking care of the place we live in. With every inch that I finish cleaning, I feel my mind getting clearer and happier. Homemaking is always a work in progress, and that's where the beauty lies. With every changing phase of our lives, we tweak our homes a little bit to comfort us just the way we want. For me, this comfort is more visual. The changing pattern of curtains, changing wall decor, even accommodating different kinds of plants with every passing year. We make changes to our outer world because something inside of us has changed. These changes are so small and delicate that we hardly ever notice them. It's only when few years have passed that we notice the difference, only to realize that our soul has evolved just like our homes. Here's a quick tip. If you have just changed your curtains a couple of days back, then just vacuum clean it to remove the layer of dust which might have settled on them. Time to clean the fridge. So here I am using a soft but thick cloth to clean the dust, which is followed by using a thin cotton handkerchief to make the surfaces shine.
These fridge magnets I have collected from my travels and a couple of them have been gifted. This whole activity of spray cleaning is so calming. It's like almost giving a delicate pieces and machines a nice wash. And the squeaky clean feel as a result is just a cherry on the cake. If you ever get anxious over the amount of cleaning you are left with then I would say don't overwhelm yourself don't try to do it all at once take it one day at a time at your own pace and you will only be left thanking yourself at the end of it all Time to take care of my plants. I try and clean the leaves as frequently as I can to help them breathe properly. Also, the way they glow after this is just divine. There is a completely different joy in watering plants and seeing them thrive right in front of my eyes. I'm sure most of you can relate to this. Nurturing Mother Earth is a way of staying grounded to our roots. It's a way of taking a pause from our everyday rush and appreciating life's simple pleasures. So guys, spraying water on leaves keeps them away from bugs and pets which spoil plants. I am currently crushing over these amber bottles. They give such a uniform and beautiful look to the section. Some essential oil 
to enhance emotional health and give a fresh vibe. This is again a favorite task of mine, changing bed sheets. The fresh feel of crisp clean bed sheets is absolutely delightful and not forgetting the childlike sleep one can get on a fresh spread of bed sheet. It is said that your mirror should always be clean so that it reflects back a person just the way he or she is and not a face smudged with dust. So with this, I close off today's video. Let me know if I should come up with part 2 of this organizing and cleaning. Also, do give this video a like if you enjoyed it and don't forget to subscribe for all things home decor and DIY. You can also follow me on Instagram for more real time updates. I am leaving my Insta handle here. Till then guys, see you in the next video. Bye!